special set of circumstances. Well, when you look at You're kidding me. Ten laps to go left in this race, and the caution just came out. This is going to be hectic right here, guys. But, yeah, Tony Kanon just wrecked. And ten laps to go left in this race. Oh, boy, we're going to have another Daytona 500. That's <laughs> good. This race hasn't been a wreck fest, but certainly a lot of cars have been wrecked out of this race. And now Dixon does not have to go slow because he's got some fuel back in, back in the tank and he can go as fast as he wants. And that'll make a difference. And then there's Will Power, one of the dominant cars of the race, sitting there in fourth. Red Carpenter fact, and Will Power have been the two dominants for today's race. Power. Let's talk about how, what he's going to do on this restart. Can he get by these three guys? We think he can. He was running really I good. mean, for, uh, for shit. Talking right now. Uh, Oh, I think boy. we got something for them for sure. Uh, they, hopefully they need to go... You know, the last time there's been this lengthy of a caution before the end of the race uh, was Phoenix or ISM. But there was a pretty long race. caution. Yeah, caution. And, and, um... It's been a solid effort so and, yeah, basically, you know, what the result of that race. It's been, it's been, well, Joseph Newgarn did win that race. Robert Wickens is so close to win that race. So here's the question. Inside the so Oreo, Sur Oreo Survey. Survey. Hope oh, I pronounce his name right. I'm not good. I'm not good at pronouncing names, but. But. We're going to have an interesting restart. Jack Harvey. Made a name building a team in sports car racing at one time mortgaged his home to keep his team alive. Now his dream to be an Indy car owner here for a second year. Harvey, former winner on the Oval in the Freedom 100, the Indy Light Series race they have here on Car Day, but making just his second 500 mile race start. And here he finds himself running in third position inside the final 10 laps. What do you think's going Didn't on? Didn't that do that? Remember, he said last year, along with Michael Shank, can't believe that they're here. It's a dream but, come true. Yeah, but like, there is wow. no doubt that your butterflies are in your stomach. And as we're looking here on the left hand side of the car, the mirror is missing for Oreo. Oh, shit. Now, he got no mirror. Sure he got no mirror. Oh, what are you going to do now? I'm like, trying his own best to talk like DW. Isn't that Corvette ZR1 looks very, looks, looks very cool. But, yeah, so. I'm surprised they're not on the big tower thing. I forget what it's called. At Indy. Alright, so when we come back to the green, we'll be seven to go. My pick to win the race is out. Elio is out. And or Sir Sir Bay and all these guys are gonna go for the win. Looks like the um, 26, I think, is gonna take the wave round. No, it's coming to bit. One to go. Flag. One to go. So that he can get up and One to go. take off from Scott Dixon. But remember, Scott Dixon, not as much fuel, but I think that... Look all these guys in the top three, and then you got Will Power, who's basically won on the road course. Oh yeah, Will Power hasn't won an Indy 500 yet. His power wills wide. On the restart, you will get passed into one. We saw that earlier in the race, so you've got to find a way to put just enough distance. This is going to be interesting. We're going to see who can do it. And, and you don't know what could happen. And what happens if there's a wreck? Well, then that's going to be very interesting. Very interesting, but... Yeah. This race has been... So far, it's been pretty good. I don't know. The pace car is long gone. I sat on my... I sat... Green, 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 green. Interesting, interesting. All right. Okay, they're going three wide. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Stefan Wilson is into the lead. And Jack Harvey is in third. Or no, second. Sorry. Scott Dixon. Are we going to have an upset winner? What's going to happen? Dude, I've never heard of Stephen Wilson, but he's he's leading the race. Wow. He's running. He has six more laps to go left in his life for Stephen Wilson. But Will Power, he's catching. He's going to catch up. I don't care who wins this race. Whoever wins this race... I'll be happy for them. We're one of these gentlemen. But the one thing I'm pretty sure everyone is not expecting for is a caution. I don't know how they're going to do it, but... Stephen Wilson has... Is this going to be the... Are you kidding me? This is going to be interesting. Oh no, Jack Harvey can keep Will Power behind him, then if he's good, oh my god, what are we gonna, who's gonna win this race? This is so interesting. Hand went down to make an adjustment on the anti roll bar to change the handling of his car. What a story for Stefan Wilson. Does he have enough fuel? Oh, he's running on fuel mileage? Oh, no! Oh, man! Will Power! Holy shit! Will Power! Just as they did it, he, ran, he runs out of fuel. Who's in second, though? That's the question I'm having. That's the question I want to know. But wow. Order sur survey. Survey. I don't know how the hell he's. I don't know how to say that name. And third is Ed Carpenter. Well, six is Ryan Hunter Ray. My favorite driver. In any car. In any car. For that matter. It looks like Will Power is going to run to the lead. He's going to run. This is... Which, compared to the race pace we've seen for a lot of the days, his blister is really fast. And the car that's following him just did a 2.16. This is Power's race. Will Power, for a number of years, talked about having difficulty... He's gonna do it. Well, power. He's gonna win. He's gonna do it. The pressure situations had difficulty with that. Got himself into position to win a championship. Had to lose one to win one. Finally, won that championship. Then the oval track racing. Here to go. He's not a good oval track racer. He's a supreme road course racer. He's good at ovals. Don't get me wrong. He's good at hand. Finishing second. He's good. Will Power's confidence level at this racetrack. Will Power, he's going to do it. So smooth and so calm and so confident all month. And now just over a lap away from this one. When he comes around, it's going to be one more mile to go. And that box that you talk about. It's going to be one more mile to go. White flag. Oh no, I just, I, and they just mentioned, mentioned Penske. Penske's gonna get his 17th in the 500. He's gonna get it. Ryan Ray is in fifth. The lap car is Charlie Kimball. You hear the radio call clear by 40 car lengths, two quarters to go. Fans on their feet waving and cheering. Well, Powers. Dreams is gonna come true today, people. Will Power wins the 2018 Indy 500. Woo! And when I and I just need to mention a couple things. Chevy won. Will Power won, and Penske won. That's great. That's just great.
Will Power first, Carpenter second, third is Dixon, fourth is Rossi, fifth, your driver, Ryan Hunter Ray, is fifth. Oh boy. That's the top five and the podium for Carpenter and Dixon. Good job. That means he's gonna drink the milk again. Kiss the bricks, baby! I knew he could do it! I had kind of a weird call. Oh my god. Right around the red side, now we This is great. This is just great. So mad. He was so determined for this one. And, um, and he did it. He said, Go celebrate. Thank you. How about that, Alan? Liz Power, husband, is for the Indy 500 winner. I think we saw earlier. How about that? It's said it's Indianapolis. You just don't know what it means. Well, that's a good thing. How about that? <laughs> How about that? How about that? Cue the bagpipes. Cue the damn bagpipes, man. Cue them. You know, I've never been so happy for a winner. But Jane, Will Power. Come on, man, climb out of that car. Okay. Drink, drink that milk, baby. Woo! -hoo -ha -ha! I don't know about you, but I actually want to know what that milk taste is like. I actually want to know. Yeah, there's his teammate, Will Power, or no, Simon Pagano. Okay, I'm gonna be such, I don't want to call such an idiot in the comments. Now we only need Joseph Newgarden and uh, Emily Castanevis to get congratulate him. Let me see. F1. Monica, Monica Grand Prix. I didn't see that race yet, but I think I'm going to watch that race right now. Or the race is, or they already did the race, but there's just a rerun. 3 p.m. So after that, I'm going to, so yeah. You know. Will Power, congratulations to you. You're an Indy 500 champion. 
And I want to, and yeah, the one thing I want to watch is the kissing of the bricks. I've only seen one driver kiss the bricks, and that's Casey Kane. Now it's going to be Will Power. You know, I've watched two um, indie, indie races, the Brickyard 400 from last year for NASCAR. That was a hectic race. This race wasn't hectic, but boy, a Chevy, but no. The two, in, the two 500, the two indie races I watch, a Chevy won, and this is just great. Yeah, your face is gonna be on a trophy on top. There's a naked man up there. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah, okay, you're all gonna call me a douchebag, but whatever. Look at. 17, 17 wins for Penske. Incredible. Wow. <laughs> so, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoy that reaction. That was a pretty that was pretty that was pretty interesting ending to a race. So, yeah. Congrats to Will Power to the Polpensky team and Chevrolet for winning their for winning for winning another Indy 500. Great job by Chevy. Anyways, uh, with that being said, I'm going to be here for a little bit. I'm gonna watch the Monaco Grand Prix, which I think they're about to play. And then after that, NASCAR Coca Cola 600. Pick to win the race though for the 600, Cal Bush. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see all of you in the next video. Bye. But yeah, and just to mention that I will be doing a race review of this race in a little bit. So hope you guys will enjoy that.